KX90. This is the introduction to Hoverbeat part 5. The first thing you need to do is go to www.makeit.no slash docs, then browse down to Hoverbit. To download the pre-made code for the hand controller, all you need to do is to click on that link and download. To download the code for the hovercraft, all you need to do is to do the exact same thing as you already did. To get the instructions on how to build the hoverbit, just click on that link. And then you can watch the instructions on your browser or you can simply download it to your computer. Everything in this manual is not difficult to understand, quite the contrary actually, it's really easy. There's a lot of pictures that's showing you exactly how to do things and the instructions are straightforward. Just pay attention when gluing the plastic bag to the base of the hover bit. In general, whatever kind of glue you're using, be careful. Click on that link for more information. Before we continue, you have to connect the USB to your computer, then connect the USB to your micro bit. And then you need to calibrate the micro bits. Every instruction you need to know is now on the LED screen. Just follow the instructions and the micro bit will be calibrated. Now, what you're gonna do is to press left click, hold down left click on a file, drag the file into the program called Make Code by Microsoft and let go of the left click. Now, after the code has loaded, you will have to make sure that the number that's written on Radio Group is the same that matches the number in the hand controller code. Now, this is important because if the numbers do not match, you will not get any signal. That means you will not be able to drive the hovercraft. And because your hoverbit is already plugged into your computer via USB, click on download and the code will automatically go to your hoverbit. And then you see a yellow light blinking. Wait until the code is fully transferred. That means the yellow light will stop blinking and the code will start. And then we're gonna do the same process with the micro bits on the controller. I'm not gonna talk you through the process and that's because we've already done the exact same thing on the hover bit. I'm just gonna show it to you. And then we're gonna do the exact same thing once again, only this time with the code for the hand controller. Hold down left click, drag the file into the program called MakeCode by Microsoft and let go of the left click. And as I've already explained, make sure that the number on radio group on this code matches the one that we previously coded. And after you have clicked on download, this is the end result on the hand controller. To download the program to be able to code all of this, go to Microsoft Store, type in the search bar Make Code, click on Make Code by Microsoft, and then click Install. I've already installed the program of course, but it will be written Install in this bar. And that's basically all you have to do to download the program called Make Code by Microsoft. Thanks for watching, I am KX90, stay tuned for the last episode.